It is Spartan 21 back again here with another gameplay of Call of Duty Black Ops 2 on the Wii U. Now this is actually a really nice gameplay I got with the foul on my live stream on the map Yemen, which I hate. And yeah, let's go ahead and get into the meat and potatoes of this mother mother. And first off, I just want to wish everybody a happy new year and I hope that 2013 actually brings, you know, good things to you guys and also will hope. 20 will mean good things for me on this channel so let's go ahead now and get past that that little hump there and let's go ahead and get into the actual commentary which is about you know the media and how they perceive with people you know and also you know being a boyfriend slash girlfriend so you know my mom has been urging me lately to you know go out there you know find someone to date and all that kind of fun stuff and it's just, you know, really hard for someone like me to do that because of, you know, I am a little bit overweight. I'm, I I mean, I am not skinny. I am I am mildly overweight. I am, I think I weigh right now 286 right now. Um, I used to weigh 235. I used to be really, you know, really muscular in high school and all that kind of stuff. And then culinary school came around and I got fat and all that kind of fun stuff. So... And it's I and, and I just you know I blame the the media for making it so hard for people like me to um, you know find a relationship. I know there's girls out there that like that, but it's just you know I just don't like how people are judged by how they look. You know, I mean you you could be like over 200 pounds and you know six one like I am, and people will go oh you're you're overweight. I don't like you. And it's just it's just you know it's ignorance. And it's like you know what if that person you know makes you happy. Or, you know, what if that person, if you don't give that person a chance, then how would you know? How would you know that person wouldn't make you the happiest person on earth? Um, and that's, you know, that's the biggest thing for me is, you know, I think I'm a nice guy. You know, I think I do good things for people. And I honestly think I'd be, like, one of the best boyfriends in the world, you know, just saying. I'm not trying to be, you know, conceited or anything. But... That's, you know, it's just, you know, everybody thinks, I mean, girls nowadays think they need to have, you know, a werewolf boyfriend or, you know, a vampire boyfriend or, you know, they always go, oh, I wish I had love like that, which, you know, they could if they actually gave people like me a chance. And it's, you know, I don't want to, I'm not, I'm not trying to be, you know, condescending to women or anything like that, but it's just, you know, that's what you're perceiving as, is, you know, you want the unobtainable, un unattainable, if I can speak English right today. Um, and, you know, if you want the unattainable, then, you know, you're you're destined to, you know, run into the bad guys and all that kind of fun stuff all the time. And, you know, and then you overlook us good guys and don't give us a chance. So, that's, you know, that's my little rant about, you know, being single for so long and, you know, the reasoning behind it and all that kind of fun stuff. So, I mean, th I mean there are, I mean, there is a girl I like. But I just don't really have the guts to really, you know, really tell her, tell her that I really do like her. Um, she is actually going to be quitting the job that she, that, because we are actually co-workers. Um, she's actually going to be quitting her real soon, so it's going to be, you know, a lot harder to contact her because of the fact that I don't, you know, I won't see her as much. Even though I don't really see her much now because I don't really work much. But... I know, and I, I just want I want to hear from you guys. What would be the best way for me to tell her that I really do like her and I really want a, a chance to, you know, try to make it work rather than just... Because that's my problem is I I don't try because I'm, you know, I, I feel like I'm always destined to fail, so that's why I never try. So, uh, in the comment section below, guys, I just want to hear from you guys what you think would be the best way for me to, do, to go about telling her that uh, about my feelings and all that kind of fun stuff. So, and uh, if you like this video, guys, make sure to throw a like on it. Um, <laughs> because if every like does help my channel. If you're new, please subscribe because every I love every single one of you guys. Every, every single one of you guys are my friends. And I really appreciate you guys. So, anyways, guys, that's going to be it for me tonight. And I'll see you guys later.
Peace.